Okay, now we're going to take a quick look at what the power prep teaches. And obviously, it's going to teach every concept that's on the exam. So every single testable concept that's on the exam is taught in great detail inside the power prep. Teaches reading comprehension, grammar, math, vocabulary, logic, and also the interplay between the various subjects. Bear in mind that grammar and math, like we've said, are the two areas with very objective, rule-based content and the places where you can make the most improvement in the shortest amount of time. Your logical reading and analytical skills have taken a lifetime to develop. They can be improved, but it takes more effort on your part than just learning some math and grammar rules. Nevertheless, the more you practice and the more you work, the better you'll get at all of it. Okay, to show you how the Power Prep teaches this content, we need to take a quick peek inside the program so you can become more familiar with the video lessons, the integrated 800 page ebook, the practice questions, the drill questions, the quizzes, and their incredibly detailed explanations because we believe that students need enormously detailed explanations that show you the correct answers but also explain why the wrong ones are wrong and also link back into the content inside the program so you can relearn it if needed. We also have flashcards and vocabulary builder among other things. So let's take a quick look at the insides of the power prep. But keep in mind this is just a quick overview. The other videos will go into much more detail. Okay, here is a close up of the landing page interface of the power prep. These are all the icons down on the tray where you navigate throughout the program. These three are introductory type um, information and this is the main section right here where you do most of your work. This is the classroom, the 800 page ebook that's integrated with the videos. These are text resources. This is the fast track or flashcards. This is a vocabulary section and this is the quiz section. So if you open the classroom, this is where all the videos are. If you wanted to learn about math, algebra, factoring the FOIL method, here are all the videos and the practice questions about that. Uh, you, you click on a video, it opens up, starts playing, and then it gives you practice questions about that content. So this is practice question one about factoring the FOIL method. You look at the question, you answer it, and then it gives you a very detailed explanation about that question. And that's the format that the classroom follows. Text resources. You, you've got outlines, workbooks, and drill books. For example, if you wanted to get more work, you can go to the drills in math, uh, go to geometry. There's 40 questions, and each one has extremely detailed explanations. So this is the explanation to question number one in the drills. Also, the tips, which are like flashcards, it goes through the same content but does it in, in a quicker fashion. So if you wanted to learn about something you already pretty much knew about it, you just want to review it, this would be the place to go. And then the vocabulary section uh, has, an, has a dictionary with over 800 words. These are all words that have shown up on the exam. There's sagacious, it gives you the, the word, it gives you the definition, it uses it in a sentence, and it's a good way to just study words. And there's also an actual video, there's a student study guide and a video workshop that goes along with it. Uh, where you have a teacher that teaches you how to put words together, uh, teaches you pieces and parts of words so that if you don't know a word on the exam, if you understand how words come together, then you may be able to figure it out on the exam. And that's what this uh, vocabulary section teaches you. You have a teacher who actually explains all that. And then the quiz section, which is really important. Um, there's a verbal and math. Uh, for example, here's the reading comp. You have five quizzes. Uh, each one has about 10 questions, so this is another place to get lots and lots of practice. So there's a passage, 
you read the passage. This one has to do with DNA. You answer questions about it. I'm just going to quickly go through that. And then at the end, it grades your results and it gives you detailed explanations about each of them. Okay, that's a quick look at the PowerPoint.